So I think one of the biggest things that we've done here is bring Catholic education to a place that isn't really used to it. I just feel special, like just lucky to be in the right place at the right time. Cause we were all, I mean, we just happened to be the first class and we all, even though we had to make that commitment to come from other schools and you know where we were kind of already established. I came from Haas Hall Bentonville and I I was not happy. I did not want to I did not want to switch. I was not comfortable with it, but I think like now and especially I think sophomore year because that's when I switched, I felt a lot of growth. I think just in my academics and my social life and in my like sports because I felt like I was being pushed here more than I would have at Haas Hall just cuz I was not I was comfortable. And so I, now I'm really grateful that I've been able to do it and be in the first class and be one of the first students, but at first it was not. <laughs> I think it's really exciting watching it grow and change, um, especially being able to be a part of it too um, and kind of fostering the freshman class too because we have, we've been here in the beginning so it's always like we've been the oldest. So it's kind of nice being able to see everyone else grow too, um, especially the first freshman class. We, we've been growing with them, and it's it's just nice because we're so close, and I've been able to see them grow up too. All of us, and there's you know there's only so so many people to go around and to to be with. Um, so whether it's basketball, whether it's performing in a play, we all do a lot of the same things, and which is I mean I don't think we'd have it any other way. Our relationships a lot closer than the average large public school graduating class. So I will be attending the University of Central Arkansas in the fall as a part of their Shedler Honors College. I've also earned the Arkansas Governor's Distinguished Scholar Award. Uh, and then among a few other academic scholarships, but those are the, the main two that I've earned. OCA has kept us academically on track and usually above and beyond what the state requirements of classes are. Um, a lot of us, I think really all of us, will get substantial scholarships to the colleges we're going to. Um, there's a lot of presidential scholarship winners, honors scholarship winners, governors, distinguished scholarship winners. I mean, there's a lot of that to go around in this class. And it's really represented us well to show uh, academically how far we've come and that we can hold our own even though we're a fledgling school.